two of the under 14 boys. We have a scratching from lane seven, which is Caulfield. On your marks. Athletes from lane one, we have Doncaster. Two, Cranbourne. Three, Diamond Valley. Four, Waverley. Five, Campbell or Melbourne. Six, Berwick. And in lane eight, we have Geelong. Very convincing fastest qualifier comes from lane five, Campbell or Melbourne. They've got a good, Set. possibly four or five points on their fellow competitors. So once again from the inside, Doncaster, Cranbourne, Diamond Valley, Waverley, Campbell or Melbourne, Berwick and Geelong. So strong running at the moment by the athlete from Waverley there from lane four. Probably just a touch in front of the Campbell or Melbourne athlete, but both still digging deep into the final part of this first leg. But Waverley going to take it first, then Campbell or Melbourne. On the outside, Berwick and also Geelong. Running very strongly. But Campbell or Melbourne, as we mentioned, possibly the stronger of the runners so far running this second leg, making their way towards the second change. Very clean running here by that Campbell Melbourne athlete in actual fact. They're going to well and truly change first right now. Possibly then Geelong, just over Berwick, Diamond Valley, Waverley, Cranbourne and Doncaster. But it is Campbell Mulvin. They're going to come across this crossover probably with a really good lead of probably about 40 metres, I might say. 35, 40. Berwick are going to come across second at that change over Geelong. Possibly Diamond Valley as well as, we'll just see who that Waverley, I think it might have been. But coming into the final stage of this race, it is well and truly Campbell or Malvin out in front. Let's keep an eye on the VBP for this one, ladies and gentlemen. Victorian best performance is 136. It's going to just miss out on that. We've gone just 136 now. But nonetheless, excellent run by Campbell or Malvin, taking out first. Second place is going to go to Berwick. Third, Diamond Valley. Fourth, Geelong. Fifth, Waverley. Six in Cranbourne. And seventh place in Doncaster. So that is the second time final for the under-14 boys, four by 200 metres.